Good evening, everybody. When you make the playoffs in baseball every year in Iowa, it's a pretty short offseason. And that's the case in Davis County, where the Mustangs are getting ready for football. Uh, it's been uh, it's been an interesting ride, trying to get a lot of things done um, here in a short period of time. And uh, we've been trying to get a little bit done every day, and uh, hopefully we're getting there. And uh, uh, well, the season's going to be ready here for us, for rather, whether we're ready for it or not. Over at Mount Pleasant, the football program has been successful because all of the players in the system learn things the right way. Got all of our coaching staff here, varsity, JV, ninth grade, and middle school. So it's a good, good way to get going, get to know each other, learn some skills the way we teach them and uh, at the varsity level. With new Kirksville football coach Jeff JQs, there will be some changes for the Tigers. In just 10 days, there will be a big Saturday of football and food. We're starting our first orange and black uh, scrimmage. It's going to be August 11th that morning. Uh, while we're scrimmaging, the parents are putting together a rummage cell here at the high school. Uh, and then that evening, we're putting together a barbecue for, for the players and communities. All local athletes need to remember no matter what sport you are playing this fall, you need to get your physical and give a copy to your coach before you start practice on Monday. You want to play golf at Kirksville? The first practice is Monday, August the 6th at the Country Club starting at 7.30 in the morning. If you're a Truman State sports fan, here's a way you can be true to your school. All you have to do is buy the True Pass. That's a uh, one-stop ticket, general admission card. It'll get you into all six home football games, the 24 men's and women's basketball games, and the 14 home volleyball games. So the one card will get you into all those games. It costs $100 for our general public. The plans for Tiger Town to create a big party zone in downtown Columbia for the first two SEC football games against Georgia and Alabama. It's been canceled because the organizers didn't have enough money Anyway, you can always party in Columbia. However, it will be all business tomorrow for the Missouri football team as the Tigers start practice. Then on September the 1st, they start the season against Southeastern Louisiana. Iowa running back DeAndre Johnson has been kicked off the team. Johnson was arrested twice over the weekend for speeding and eluding police and having a loud party. Yesterday, as a Tumwis, Colin Scholes was named third team All-State. Uh, I felt pretty honored to be on the team and realized hard work pays off. In Olympic news, eight badminton players have been kicked out of the games because they were trying to lose in order to play easier opponents in the next round. And American Nathan Adrian won gold in the men's 100 freestyle. 